like Mr. Musk thinks? Are we living in simulation? I find it hard to argue against that possibility. Meaning? Meaning. You look at our computing power today, and you say, I have the power to program a world inside of a computer. Well, imagine in the future where you have even more power than that. And you can create characters that have, for example, free will, or their own perception of free will. So this is a world, and I program in the laws that govern that world. That world will have its own laws of physics and chemistry and biology. Now, you're a character in that world, and you think you have free will, and you say, I want to invent a computer. So you do. Hey, I want to create a world in my computer. And then that world creates a world in its computer. And then you have simulations all the way down. So now you lay out all these universes and throw a dart. Which of these universes are you most likely to hit? The original one that started it? Or the countless simulations, the daughter simulations that uh, unfolded thereafter? You're going, to hit a sim you're going to hit one of the simulations. So statistically, based on that argument, which first appeared by a, a philosopher from Oxford named Nick Bostrom back in the 1990s, right when computers were becoming real enough to think this through. Um, it's, uh, it's hard to argue against the possibility that all of us are not just the creation of some kid in a parent's basement programming up a world for their own entertainment. And then every time something weird happens in the world, some disruptive leader takes charge. And I wonder if that programmer just got bored and had to stir the pot. So they throw somebody in there just, to, just to, for their own entertainment. For me, that's some of the best evidence that we live in a simulation. Because this happens every time uh, there's peace and tranquility in the world. But if it's true, what can we do about it? If like the Truman movie, or there was that, we're in that. Yeah, well, he can try to escape by going in the Truman movie to go through the barrier. Yeah. But yeah, if you're if you were programmed by somebody, yeah, no, there's nothing you can. So do. what difference does it make if I'm programmed by someone? I, I guess it, I don't know it. I guess it doesn't make any difference at all. Watch new episodes of Larry King now Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.